Man, finally made it to Chicago for this uh, this year summit. Uh, for those who don't know, I'll, I'll put the link somewhere. It's uh, Angel Investment Summit. We were invited to uh, pitch, and uh, hopefully I'll have a chance to record the pitch, but it's cold as hell, man. So this is day, day two. Yeah, because we landed yesterday. I was dead. So um, I, I'm just going to start today. So let's do day one. Uh, but nice place, man. And even though it's, uh, it's cold out here, I had a chance to check it out. This is my second time in uh, Chicago. I haven't been here in a long, long time. But uh, first time in this conference. I didn't even know uh, this summit had existed. I know there's a lot of things happening in the investment space, but uh, it's going to be in interesting. And the most int interesting thing will be, and don't quote me on this, but I'll still say it, is how people react to what ARED and other technology here from Africa are, because we'll be dealing with people, most of the people here ne either never been to Africa, don't understand the ecosystem, or don't know what the problematic is. So it will be interesting to get the reaction of what, uh, after our pitch, of what what really the problem is, and if they feel like, they, is this really a problem? Uh, so stay tuned, man, check it out. Don't fear failure. As long as it's not gonna kill you, it's gonna make you what? Stronger. guys you know today is pitch day uh so i've learned a lot man uh these past few days um so ACA summit i mean the largest uh angel investment uh, association uh in the states over fourteen thousand members i mean this is what we need man this is what we need the more I, every time i travel you know, in the States, and I see some of the, the ecosystem already built in. We, we need those things, man. I know there's angel investors in, in Africa. I know there's uh, uh, companies or organizations that are trying to build uh, th those uh, infrastructure and ecosystem and contacts, but we we have to speed up the process, man. We we, we definitely have to, to move much, much faster. We, we, we have no luxury. This is what I say about Africa. There's no luxury for time wasting. There's no luxury for that. We have a tendency to, you know, take our time to do things, man. And we don't. We don't, man. The, 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 the population is going to double. What are we going to do, man? We need to create jobs. We need to speed up process. But anyway, this particular video is not about all this uh, aspect. As you can see, I'm working while I'm at the conference. But uh, the key thing... Um, We'll be sharing the pitch. Hopefully, I'll, I'll, I'll get somebody to, to record the pitch right quick. And uh, But this is about pitching. You know, uh, it never stops. And, and, and I want you guys, entrepreneur out there, to, to understand these things. If you're more tech than business, find somebody in your team or yourself to, to learn your pitch. It doesn't. I've been in business six years. I'm still pitching. You know, so there there is no timeline unless until you reach a certain level um and yes some companies don't need to pitch they they, they they just got the deals but if you're a regular regular company you have to hustle to get the money and all those things you have to be pitching man you have to be pitching you have to be ready to pitch at any given time we have 30 companies right now in this uh summit so it's, it's not a small uh, it's not just African companies. Uh, they, 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 a lot of them are American companies, and they're pitching. A lot of them been in business 10, 12, 13, 15 years, and they're raising money. If you're raising money, you got to pitch. 
you know, so humble yourself, man. If you think you reach a certain level and I don't need to do this, I don't need to do that, you're just not going to make it. Um, and, um, I mean, but when you do something long enough, of course, you become at some point good at it. But pitch, 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 practice your pitch, pivot when you pivot, add your pivoting on your pitch, make it simple. Uh, that's the key thing I want to say. Keep things simple for people to quickly understand. You can get into the detail afterward when somebody's the pitching, especially this is a 90 second pitch. You're not going to be able to break down your revenues and all. No, the idea is to, to, to build interest. So it's just build interest, make, make, make the, the information interesting enough for an investor to come in and say, hey, I need more information. They understand that. They know that the pitch is not about uh, uh, telling them everything about your business, but it's about to be able to be good enough to summarize your business where it makes sense, number one, has to be making sense. Number two, they have to capture the fact that your, your, your business or your solution is unique. You know, number three, they have to understand what problem you're solving. Uh, and number four, they have to make sure that the market size is, is a nice market size where they can get a return at some point. You know, if you can fulfill those four key things, man, I think you'll be all right, you know. So check out the pitch. Uh, I'll make sure I get the, 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 the pitch somewhere. ACA Summit is a very interesting summit. If you have an opportunity or a chance to to participate or get engaged, man, it's a very interesting uh, uh, place. The only challenge, unfortunately, is a lot of them don't invest in Africa. They were never invested in Africa, so it's a, it's if you're an African company, I wouldn't put too much energy on it. But it's always great to network. You know, I met a lot of investors that may not invest in Africa, but may know somebody who's interested in the African market. <laughs> So my name is Henry Nyakamudi. Uh, <clears throat> I've been an entrepreneur now for 20 years. And in 2013, I started a company called AWED, which is a hardware as a platform uh, service uh, company based in Rwanda. So um, in most African countries today, you can basically pay your bills over the phone. You can even access government services over your phone. But one of the biggest challenge for low income uh, areas is number one, lack of access to electricity. Less than 20% of the people have access to electricity in their home. And less than 30% of the population has access to connectivity. And that's why AirAid was born. So we're the first and only one-stop shop solar kiosk platform to bridge the gap in digital access to digital services and connectivity using Wi-Fi solution. We spent five years developing this technology. Um, Last year alone, we served around 40,000 unique customers uh, in Rwanda, and uh, we did around 117,000 digital transactions. This year, we have around 80 kiosks in two countries, and we started our expansion plan. We're just getting started, guys. So we've been able to achieve all this uh, with a small team of six people within six years. Imagine what we can do with your support. If you guys are serious and looking for a great opportunity, Please come downstairs and check out our booth. Thank you. What's up, everybody? First of all, thank you for watching all the videos. I'm working on a project right now that I'm really, really passionate about and really excited. And I truly believe with your participation, we're going to achieve our goal. It's called the 50K Challenge. And that's 50,000 copies we need to sell of the book. Out of every 20 sales, I'll be giving one book to a young entrepreneur or young students. And out of every 500 sales, I'll do a one week mentorship to a young entrepreneur where I go in detail, help them out about their business. What I would need from you guys is if you haven't got the book, please get it. If you don't read, no problem. Share on social media about the book, you know, with your network. Finally, you can get it, you know, a gift for somebody else. I truly believe with your support, I can achieve that goal, guys. So share the books. If you haven't got it, get it. If you don't like to read, buy it for somebody else. And please share it also on social media. Thank you.
Ha, ha, ha.